And he was telling him, you know, if you be, if you are the son of God, then I need for you to do these things. Resist the devil. And he's telling the devil, get behind thee, Satan. Resist him. Let your character shine like God's. Let us love one another. Let us have that humble spirit. Let us go forth and be as God would have us to be. Taking in the word of God. Walking in the spirit of God. Not in flesh, but in the spirit of God. Letting him lead us and guide us in the way that we should go. But the fruit of the spirit is love, joy, peace, long-suffering, gentleness, goodness, meekness, faith, temperance. This is the Christian characteristic. This is the characteristics of God. May the Lord bless you and keep you. Amen. Amen. We give glory and honor to God. Amen. For Lady Blizzard and the word of God that she had presented unto us. Amen. Coming from Galatians chapter 5. Amen. And she focused in on the fruit of the Spirit. Amen. From Galatians chapter 5, verses 22 and 23. And we just thank God for the word that has gone forth. And we pray that you've heard something to help you. Amen. As you grow and walk in your Christian journey. Amen. When we look at that, just real briefly, <clears throat> notice it says fruit. Amen. Of the Spirit. So all these things that are listed here are elements of the one spirit. So when you receive the Holy Ghost or the spirit of God in you, all these attributes should be a part of your being. Amen. So not just one, not just two, but all of them. Amen. So when we come to God and repent of our sins and turn our lives over to him and we're working on our soul salvation and we are baptized in his name, we are filled with his precious Holy Ghost. These are the elements or the characteristics that we should find in you as you start from that point and grow in God and mature in him by having the fruit of the spirit, which incorporates all these elements, love, joy, peace, long suffering, gentleness, goodness, faith, meekness, and temperance. And it says, and against such, there is no law. Amen. Nothing can come against you when you receive the Holy Ghost, and you develop the characteristics of Christ. Amen. We just love the Lord on today. We thank God for the songs of praises. We thank God for the scripture and the prayer and the word. And we just want to grow in God, grow in faith. And we here at Blessed Ministries are just wanting to present Christ to the world. We're teaching from the scriptures, amen, and presenting Christ to you, amen, each and every week. We just love the Lord on today. We pray that you've gotten something out of it, and we pray that um, if you have any questions, amen, we ask that you reach out unto us um, via the email that's on the screen, amen. At a minimum, we ask that you find a Bible-believing church where you are located, amen, one that is teaching the truth and, che te and preaching and teaching Jesus Christ, amen. We pray, we are praying for you, and we ask that you continue to pray for us, amen. We just love the Lord, we just want to continue to grow in God grow in faith and learn the word of God that we may continue to love and trust in him and have faith in him and grow in him that in the end when he returns he can say well done thy good and faithful servant we just love the Lord of today and we're going to conclude our service on today with a dismissal prayer but before we do that again we want to say happy Mother's Day to all the mothers on today and we just love you and we just pray that God will truly bless you on this day as well as as well as throughout the remainder of this week, we pray that God will be with you.
throughout this week. Let us pray. Father God, in the precious name of Jesus, Lord God, we thank you, God, for the fruit of the Spirit. We thank you for these examples of these elements that are in the spirit of the Holy Ghost that is within us, oh God. Allow us to, uh, to walk in it and to actually live and uh, apply these characteristics in our daily lives, wherever it may be, in our workplaces, in our home, in the store, as we're driving through, driving throughout the, um, the roadways, amen. Uh, we do want to have an attitude of road rage and, and uh, have a bitter spirit towards our co-workers and different issues of life that may come our way. Lord, we want to have your spirit within us, oh God, to allow us to act appropriately, oh God, to show a Christian uh, manner, uh, amen. We just thank you and praise you right now, God. I ask you to continue to bless me and my family, bless those, all those that are watching and listening in a mighty way. We just thank you, we praise you, we glorify you on today, oh God. We give all the glory, honor, and praise. And in Jesus' name we pray. Let every heart say amen.